The Holy Spirit has a message for your day, and I believe that this is going to help your relationship with God. When it comes to the enemy's game, it's in the mental and emotional arena. The Bible points us not to condone, but to expose the evil works of darkness. And that's what this video is going to be about. Satan will try to play tricks and tempt us to get us to make harmful decisions. And remember, God never tempts us, but he has been tempted himself so he can relate and he has made a way of escape. And Satan has to operate in deception because he is already defeated. So he has to try to use our weaknesses against us. But you see, in our weakness, God's power is made perfect. God already has this aspect covered. So Satan tries to get us to willfully make the wrong choices so he can try to accuse us before God. God has the final say with the cross, but the more that we can recognize Satan's plots, we can keep ourselves from giving room to the devil to be in our emotions and thoughts. And as we put this into practice, we will become more aware of Satan and his tactics. And there's also a sin nature that is in us that God paid for and he gives us his Holy Spirit for us to combat. So Satan wants to use us against ourselves to get us to quit on God. He tries to shame us and degrade us to keep us inefficient for God's work here on earth. But I'm here to tell you through the power of God we are triumphant over all the enemy's works. Nothing can hold us back unless we let it. And nothing can hold us back when God is running this race with us. If you've fallen, get up again. God is not done with you yet. You have a beautiful purpose here on this earth. So go seek the truth in God's word and become more disciplined in the faith. And go affect this world for Jesus' sake before he calls us home. Thank you for watching to the end. Stay encouraged in Jesus' name.